Hey guys, Mimsy Bell here. We're back in Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, and uh, I forgot to go get blood from somebody. You know what? Fuck it, I don't really care. I got a whole thing. I don't care. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I'm not gonna restart this already. So we're going to go see the Giovanni. Good lord, I can't speak. We're gonna go see them. And I gotta get okay. I do remember for um okay for her. There we go. There's a I gotta find book. So the map hat. Hi. What? Okay, that was weird. Hi. Yeah, what is it? Okay, is this too funny, man? Giovanni, oh yeah, here's the place. I haven't met you before. Are you a family member, member of the family? Wow. She's obviously very drunk. <laughs> um, yes, I am. Is that right? Hell of a family to be born into or married into or both. You have an invitation with you? No, I don't. Hey, don't worry about it. I'm sure they'll let you in. Just tell them that they just tell them you just tell them you lost it. <laughs> I lose things all the time. Okay, I'll do that. Hold on, do you have an invitation? Did I just say I have an invitation? If I did, yeah, I have an invitation. Give me your invitation. My husband is he's a big tough guy, so you can you can kiss my ass, honey. Fuck you. Whatever, forget it. Can I not do you? Yes, what is it? Your wife. Oh, there we go. Your, your wife has problems. Is your wife okay? She'll be fine after I get a pot of coffee in her. Um. Smack her around. <laughs> By you, I worry about her embarrassing me. Well, she did pretty much cause the last function to come to a screeching halt. That woman has the self control of a pubescent chimpanzee. You married her. Oh my gosh, she's puking Maria. blood. I'm going home. I'll take that, and I'll take that. Thank you. Didn't think that was going to happen, but I'll take it. <laughs> what the hell? There's something around that spot. Hi. You alright? Okay. Anyone else I can talk to? You? But what is it? What? Okay. Oh. I'm stuck. <laughs> okay. Well. We're gonna do this again. Hold on. No, I want to load. Load. Okay, well, we're, we're gonna try- <laughs> We're gonna try this crap again. Okay. What is going on with this? So don't walk on that. Yes, what is Nothing. I apparently I thought you first. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I am. Is that right? Maria. Okay, no, not in her yes, name. Is... Wife, okay. Well, she did pretty much. Come, over. Come on, Maria. We're going home. All right. Um. Fuck it. I'm just taking hers. Oh, hold on. No, God damn it. Okay, I'm going to walk around this way now. Because apparently you walk on that, you're fucked. Can I talk to you right here? You? Maybe? Nope. 
Can I talk to you? No? Okay, hold on. Okay. Wait. No, that was just him. Okay, never mind. Ah, hello. You have invitation. What the fuck? Sure, it's right here. I thought it was here. Um, uh, no, I have it. Mm. Please have a wonderful time. Alrighty. Um, okay, I was about to say, I'm stuck. Alright. Alright, so. You can go in here and save if it doesn't save already. It's gonna save. Yeah, that's saved. Okay, good. Hi, bye. What the fuck? Well, that's obviously a door. So is that. Oh, well, look at that. I guess that's one way to get past everybody. Uh, you see. I'm in the kitchen! Doing bad things. <laughs> this is actually kind of fun. I guess that's because I have a high enough perspective or something that I hit shift. No, I didn't. Okay, yay! The fuck is the pool? Hold up. <laughs> Alright. Not sure if I should be doing this, but I'm doing it. I'm at the pool. Asha! I swim. <laughs> and I get up. <laughs> oh lord. Alright, so... It's over here. Ah! Okay. Where am I going? Hi! I'm in the back. Get out to you? Oh! Fuck! Are you fucking kidding me? Help! Help! Can you not see me? Help! No! Okay. That's what I get. That's what I get for exploring. I should go talk to people first. Oh god, I'm just gonna go talk to people. Might as well be a costume party. Everyone's smiling, pretending this isn't a pageant put on by the patriarch of this family. Fine. But this is a contest, and I came to win. What are you talking about? If you don't even know about the contest, then you really don't have to worry about winning it. I don't wanna... Um, I don't think I should just straight up ask her. Right. Okay. Could I do this again? Hey there, Adam Dunsern. I don't think we've met. You are? I'm apparently Maria now. Maria, pleasure to meet you. What line of work are you in? Um, Chris Cardarver. Um... I don't know what sounds the best. I'm a real estate agent. Myself, I'm an investor. I'm just gonna go down the line. <laughs> Great business, lot of potential. For example, I got the inside track on this company right now. And let me tell you, when this company goes public, everyone's going to wish they had a piece of it. Tell me more. Well, it's a biotech firm. You know they're working on growing replacement organs. Really fascinating technology. In a couple of years, I'd bet everyone will be going to them for parts. I figure an investment of fifty thousand dollars could be easily tripled in five. I'm giving you my fucking money. Um, third one. You take risks in this game. Sometimes you make a million. Sometimes you lose a million. The economy changes. It's had problems lately, but it's bound to rocket back any week now. Yeah. You have been very stressed. I can't speak today. Not only am I having problems getting stuck in places, I can't speak today. 
most people here, they've got cash they don't know what to do with. And if one of us falls on hard times, don't you think, as family, they're obligated to help him out? Besides, I get the kiss tonight. Everyone will be investing with me. In fact, if I could ensure my place at the grown-ups table by, say, drawing some attention away from my financial shortcomings, I'd be guaranteed the kiss. Know any dirt about the others I could use? I can't pay you, but I got this watch and this ring. What the fuck are we talking about kiss? Whatever. Uh, yeah, whatever. Sorry, you can't come in here right now. Okay, I'm pretty sure you told me something. Can I talk to you? Yes, I can. Okay, whatever. I see pink. Oh, I'm Christopher. Giovanni. And you are... Went straight talking. <sighs> Another person at the party who's not a Giovanni. I mean, forget it. What is it? Call me paranoid. But how do I know I can trust you? You seem used to it. I've got a secret. I've been afraid to tell people as well. You go first. If it's anything like mine, I'll tell you what's bothering me. Um. <clears throat> I'm dating a six-year-old. What the fuck? I don't think anything about the first one. Is this gonna be a second or a third? I don't know. Let's go with the third. I'm in the closet, if you know what I mean. Really. In this family, that's that kind of thing can get you excommunicated if you're not. Yes, I picked the right one. Well, all right. Do you want to know what's on my mind? I'll tell you. I found out a few months ago. My mother had an affair before I was born. Turns out my father isn't a Giovanni at all. My real father is this writer named Michael Avalon. If anyone found out, well, I might never rise up in this family. Uh. If I found some dirt on the other rows, would you be interested? Yeah, I guess I would. Um, I'm gonna wait and hold off. I wanna see who else I can talk to first. Actually, huh? I wonder, can I talk to you again? Hmm. Mira. Mira Giovanni. Mm-hmm. What? Varafate Fortare. Dyke. Okay, God. Oh. <laughs> she got all offensive on me. They gather us up here to decide just who's the best and brightest of this generation is. The lucky few are given the real power in this family. But some of us need to win more than others. Oh, forget it. You wouldn't understand. I'm very interested. Uncle Bruno. Since I was a kid, he's been the patriarch of this family. Except he hasn't aged a day. I met with a senator from Massachusetts who asked me if I was related to Bruno Giovanni. Said Uncle Bruno helped him with his first campaign back in 1950. We've all heard the rumors. The core of our family, they never age. They're secretive. Whispers of blood magic and a kiss. Whatever it is, they pick the very best of us for it. I do anything to be picked. I've made some errors in judgment, but I've lobbied hard for this family's interests. Hey, if you, if you wanna, like, cause I know what it is, I can give it to you. <laughs> errors in judgment, for example. What? Forget it. I'm not saying anything about that. Even the best of us makes mistakes, it's obvious. It's obviously set you on this path. I just met you. I like you, but I can't tell anyone. It's too personal. Sometimes you do things you regret. And if someone here found out, they'd use it to destroy my chances at the family ever letting me into their inner circle. You're not the only one. You couldn't possibly understand. Um. Okay, first one's not gonna matter. Fourth one's not probably gonna matter. I don't think. Maybe the second one? If not, I'm gonna redo all this then. I did something ha -ha! because it made me feel Sorry. alive. If you've never tasted it, you wouldn't understand. But a few months ago I shared a hit with somebody I thought was clean. I tested positive last week. Ooh. 
I won't have to worry about this disease if the family accepts me into the inner circle. I won't have to worry about a thing ever. I'm on a lot of politicians' Christmas card lists, and this family knows I've swung a lot of votes for it, but... I'll spare no expense for a lock. I want to be in that circle of power, and I won't let blood get in the way. And of course, when your time comes, I'll pay back the favor. So far, even though I'm not part of this family, but still, let's say I am part of this family. So far, the other two aren't gonna do shit for me, really. <laughs> She's the only one that's really come straight forward. I mean, the guy, that one guy says, oh, I'm gonna give you a watch and a ring. Big fucking whoop. I can go run around the city and find two, the, all that in like, no time at all. That guy, I don't even remember. He just wanted another duck. He, bleh. He just wanted another dirt. I had to go back and talk to him real quick. Um, let's see what I can dig up. So far, fuck you. What were you gonna do for me? Anything? What? Oh, uh, sure. Okay. Do you know Uncle Bruno? Nothing to be concerned about. Fuck. No, I don't even like you. Cause you're just. Nope. I like you. Oh. Yes. Um. Okay. If I can only tell her about one of them, um, it'd probably be the fair thing, because for them it's all about family. So he's not really a Giovanni. He's family, but he's not really a Giovanni. And Cecilia had an affair. If Chris isn't really a Giovanni, it won't sit well at all with Bruno. So sorry, cousin. Here, these bills represent Chris's entire future. Spend them wisely. Okay. Oh, I can tell her about both. Good. Adam broke. A few years ago, they did an article on him in the business section. <laughs> Money's practically more important than God to this family. I'll make sure Uncle Bruno somehow overhears this. Take this. It's more than Adam's worth. For your assistance, you can be certain that when I have my way, I'll bring you into the fold. If you wish. All I have to do is set the rumor mill in motion, and I'm as good as in. Excuse me. Works with me. Um. Hi, that's so green. Okay. Whatever. Freaking works with me. Oh, that was actually a question. They know I'm broke. I'm ruined. I might as well just go hang myself. That was fucking quick. <laughs> I told you that in confidence. Rest assured, if I go down, I'm taking you with me. Hey, I have another secret. I'm not even part of this fucking family. <laughs> um, could I talk to either of you? Hi. How are you? Oh, I can't talk to you. Hi. Um. Okay. <laughs> He's still really mad over there. Hi. Uh, hi. I'm, um. Uh... Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Um, thanks. Nadia Milliner. It's a pleasure to meet you, Maria. Are you from the Chicago Rosalinis? Maybe. Oh, you must give my regards to Great Aunt Frances when you get back. I stayed with her last time I was out that way. She was very sweet to me. Alrighty. I'm working on my master's out here. I'm from back east. The Giovannis have been nice enough to let me stay here while I finish up my studies. I've learned a great deal from them, like you wouldn't believe. For example? I, um, I really can't say much about that. Oh, come on, you can tell me we're all family, aren't we? I know about your... I know a little about our family secrets. The dead tell you tales too. What? I don't know, let's go with that one. There's something I want to show you, but you absolutely can't tell anyone, even other people here, okay? Follow me. Come on. We're going. Ooh, I see sparkly too. I guess if I didn't talk to her, I could have got here this way then. Ooh. Come on. I'm coming. 
goodness. Come I'm, on. My lord. Don't make me regret this. You know, I know where the fuck you're taking me. Oh. Take me to a loading screen. I guess that's a good thing. As long as I don't get stuck on anything. Come on. There you go. Don't you fucking get stuck! I see a thing! Oh! It's a fucking book. Hell yeah. Can I go through here? No? Okay. What am I doing? You know what they do in this room? Looks like an embalming room or in a funeral parlor. That's what it looks like. Mm-hmm. Know what they do with the corpses? Don't tell me they're having sex. <laughs> Please don't tell me sex. <laughs> um, wow. Dress them up like Vikings, freeze them in the ice, and drop them in the ocean. Um, I'm just gonna say no idea. <laughs> it's probably the safest pet. I shouldn't do this, but why don't I show you? It gets pretty weird from here. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, and be ready to run. You'll understand when it happens. Follow me. <sighs> I'm gonna follow her. Although I really wanted to see where that goes. Although it could be going to the same place because it's going down and we're going down. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Oh, holy shit. Hi. They don't usually attack. Just don't provoke them. Honey, I think they'll attack me. Fuck me. Hi. Hello. No, they're attacking! Oh, fuck, I see a thing. Gimme. Give Gimme. Give Just. What's happening? They're coming to get us. Oh my gosh, we've got to get They know I'm a vampire. Run, bitch! <laughs> oh, shit. No! Stop it! No! Get the fuck off of me! Oh fuck, I'm fucked. I'm stuck! I'm stuck in a- I'm stuck in a corner! Can I go through here? Damn it! No! Damn it! <laughs> I can't be invisible. Can I make them go up? Damn! No, I can just make them stop. Okay, so I can at least do that. Get up! Go upstairs! God, you're so stupid. If you die, I don't care. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to, like, leave? I want to get through here. I don't know what to do. Go away. What the fuck? He, like, stood up and then laid back down. Am I supposed to, like, kill him or something? I don't know what to do. die. Oh my god. Your head like disappeared for a second, dude. I want to get through- oh shit! Okay. Can I go through here? Yeah, I can go through here. She's on her fucking own. La, la, la. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a loading screen. Mmm, itchy. What time is it? I'm sorry, I'm trying to put this, get a quick recording in real fast because I actually have to. Okay, I actually have to go somewhere later. Can I jump over this? I don't know.
What the fuck? It's not gonna... Oh, goody. I don't have to deal with that shit. It works with me. It's... Come on. Oh, okay, that is the door. Okay. But what I was saying is that I was trying to get a this recorded real quick before I actually have to go somewhere. I'm actually meeting a friend somewhere, so I'm trying to get this in before I have to leave because I forgot to record yesterday. And Really, by I forgot to record yesterday was I didn't feel like recording yesterday. I was too busy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Let's just say I freaking didn't go to sleep that night until like 7 in the morning. Then I didn't wake up till like 5 and I just didn't feel like doing shit then. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> But I'm getting this in, so that's all my hair suit. Can I go? Yes, I can. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just going. Hi! Go away. Oh, okay. Ah! Okay, now where am I going into? Game saved. I need blood. Let's do one more. No, 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 I don't have to worry about it for a while. Really? What am I doing? Kindred. Your presence here violates the agreement between our leaders. Leave now or face the consequences of your actions. Okay, I was thinking who the fuck you are, but now I know who you're coming from. Oh! <laughs> That's, hey, look, look around him. There's a sarcophagus. I can't speak. There is an alliance between your leader, LaCroix, and Mistress Ming Zhao. You violate the agreement. If you do not leave, we are not responsible for your death. So that means I'm not responsible for your death? Okay. <laughs> uh, lines are you talking about? We'll give you one more chance to leave this place and keep your life. You will go? Um... I gotta stay, I'm sorry. The time for decisions has passed. We Chang brothers accept your life graciously. Um already then? What the fuck? No 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 no. Okay. What the fuck was that? Too much shit going on. Oh shit. Oh shit. Can I make you go up? I can. Damn it. Just keep doing this. Holy shit, he threw fire at me. Okay. Please that no oh, god damn it. You die. Why can't I hit you? Is it because you're in the middle of that shit? Oh my god, you like forever glitched or something? No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, stop doing that. Get away from me. Yes, I killed one. What the fuck? What kind of pose is that? What the hell? 
<laughs> it works! <laughs> I don't care if it's cheap, it works. And I don't feel like I'm gonna sit here and... Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, there you are. <gasps> no! God damn it! What kind of scream was that? Fucking hell. Oh my god. It's fucking ridiculous. Alright, I'm just gonna skip through this. Yeah, I know, I know. Doesn't matter what the fuck I say. The time. Let me get purge back. Shit! What the f fuck? Damn it! She's moving on her own. No, god damn it! Fuck this shit! Aren't you healing? No! Ah, you hit your own brother! Dumbass! Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, hi. Ha. No fuck out of there. The fuck is that? Where'd he go? 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 Ah, I win! Give me that shit. Hello? What? was that? That fight was fucking annoying. And no one's questioning this. No one in the Giovanni family is questioning this shit right now. Whatever. They're just gonna slowly drive off. <laughs> what the fuck ever. <laughs> just gonna go with it. But we actually have it now. Good God. Does it mean I'm getting closer to the end now? Or, well, I'm closer to the end than I was before? Hello. Hey, Beckett. Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you? Well, you know what? Fuck you two. My wunderkind returns. In my entire court, I knew there was only one who could have succeeded in this task. Finally. The Ancoran sarcophagus is ours. Come. I've granted Beckett's request to study and document all the markings of the sarcophagus. You've met Beckett, haven't you? Let's go take a look inside and see what the commotion around the city has really been all about. I'd rather not open it. Just, you know. Eh, whatever. Um, I'm gonna ask him about him in the third one. Before we do that, I need your answer. What? Preposterous. No kindred would trust them, nor would they trust us. Did Jack tell you that? Because it sounds like you've been taken for a fool. Why are you talking about Jack? Why why you go straight to Jack? What a Jack Well It's Jack, so No, tell about them. And you believed them. 
They've been trying to take over L.A. for years. It's a ruse, a falsehood spread to undermine my rule and turn kindred against each other, thin our ranks. They are duplicitous, evil creatures. Did they not try to kill you? <sighs> Insurance. They lied to you in case you lived through the encounter. They hoped to create dissension in the ranks, rumors. It's a trick older than you or I. Eh. Whatever. I, I believe you. Whatever. I just said this to make him fucking happy. I don't trust him at all. What have you assessed so far? Unfortunately for the Heralds of Doom, it appears we won't be opening Pandora's box. The markings, as far as I can tell, are of Assyrian origin. An extraordinary piece, but nothing earth-shattering. I see. Then there is no good reason why we shouldn't open it. <laughs> <clears throat> Dumbass. Budge. Beckett, do you see any mechanism for the lid? I haven't as yet had a chance to pour over it with my fine-tooth comb. I think I have one in my bag. <clears throat> why won't it... Why won't it open, Beckett? And you, I thought you said it looked as if it had been opened on the Dane. I want... Shut to up! Open. You, you and Beckett, figure out a way to open it. I need to know what's inside. I have other matters to attend to. Come get me when a solution has been found. God, you hate him. Ah, the depths to which I'll sink to prove others wrong. The young ones get so temperamental. Fortunately for Sebastian, is it? I'd already made up my mind to open the sarcophagus, if only to show the city that Gehenna, contrary to popular belief, has not begun. Okay. What do you think's inside? Put your ear to it. I'll shake it. And you tell me what you think's in Fuck you! <laughs> God. Hmm. Fortunately for us, I know of someone who has distinguished himself in this field. Who? His name is Dr. Ingvar Johansson, a professor of archaeology from Norway. He was the one responsible for finding the sarcophagus, and as far as I know, the only authority on its origin and design. Okay, we're gonna find him. Until yesterday, he could have been found in his suite at the Empire Hotel downtown. But when I stopped by earlier this evening, all I found was spilt coffee on a morning paper. It appears he's been abducted. No fucking course. Um, by who? I detected the scent of myrrh incense, which is usually burned in monasteries. Also, I found beach sand in part of a muddy footprint. Putting two and two together, I located a monastery near a beach in Malibu, where I believe hunters are holding Johansson captive. <sighs> Fucking course. Hmm. So what do we do? The hunters abducted Dr. Johansson for his own protection. Or at least that's how they've justified it. He's being held by the Society of Leopold and used quite ingeniously as bait for Prince LaCroix's minions. Lovely. Society? Sebastian mentioned you ran into one of the hunters from the Society of Leopold some time ago. They're so secret a church organization, I don't even think they know if they exist. But essentially, they're murderers for Christ or some such deity. Okay. Um. You'll have to go to the monastery and find a way into the tunnels beneath where the hunters are holding Johansson. I'm afraid I can't accompany you, but then it's best you go alone. Too many of us might set them off, like fundamentalists on contrary opinion. How do I get there? I wouldn't recommend walking. Certainly Sebastian's already provided cab fare. I'm sure he always spares no expense when archaeology is at stake. Mm, let's see what can I ask him. Excellent. <laughs> he likes to ask questions. Anything else you can tell me? The society, for the most part, knows very little about us. But they do know how to kill and torture us, and that's enough. Also, some of them exhibit powers that can make them quite formidable. Best not to announce yourself. 
Mm, I'm just gonna go down the line for right now. Well, if we open it up and the world ends, then yes. If we open it up and the world does not end, then no. I'd wager the <laughs> You're just fucking funny, aren't you? How any sane kindred could think these poor unfortunates are an immediate threat to us is absurd. Most were afraid, or at the very least uneasy, around me. Tragic. Their desperation could very well hold the spark of revolution, however. Tell me about yourself. Hmm. I've said quite a lot about myself already. I know even less about you than you do me. Why don't you tell me about yourself? Like yourself, I consider myself somewhat a scholar. I appreciate your interest in me. I'm fascinated by you. Uh... Um... I don't know. I mean, my 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 thing is, if I see pink, I'm gonna choose pink. I'll, I'll just I'll stick with it. It's not gonna work, but I'll stick with it. Sometimes I think the Nosferatu are justified in their prejudices, but to each their own, I eh. suppose. Unless you've got further questions, I'd really like to get back to looking at the sarcophagus. Whatever. Um, I don't know. Was there anything else I could ask? Excellent. Whatever. Remember, Dr. Johansson is an innocent. He has no idea we actually exist. Try not to put the idea I'm in I'm not going head. to. I'm not stupid. Whatever. Um, I need to get up out of here. I gotta go back to Chinatown. I think I may try to go to Chinatown first before I actually go to the monastery because... I, I need to try to find that chalice. I don't know where it would be. So, I mean, I'm not going to do it right now because this is the end of the episode. So. Alright, but like I said, this is the end of the episode, so I will, <laughs> I will talk to you guys later. Bye!